Well, in Canada's north, mental health supports can be very hard to come by. But a woman in Nunavut is using social media to reach out and connect with people, offering them encouragement and a moment's worth living. More like this one. Today, I think you should stay alive for the Inuk love language. The kunik, the kunichak, the akak, and the mm. I don't have a baby, so my baby girl works. Ah. <laughs> Well, we first told you about Annie Buscemi and her effort to draw lack, attention to the lack of mental health supports in Nunavut. That was in Kelsey's Good News segment. So we are honored to speak with Annie today. Welcome to your morning. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you for having me. Boy, your stories make all of us smile. Annie, what, what was the thought behind first posting these videos? Um, the first initial shot, the first initial thought actually came from another TikTok creator, but it also really stemmed from my own um, mental health issues. And what are some of the uh, mental health issues you struggle with? Um, I struggle a lot with um, anxiety and also depression. Um, I was diagnosed back in 2017, I think, and um, yeah. Um, how do they help you, Annie? I know that you're putting them out there for other people, but how do they help you personally? Um, they. It really helps me. Um, it um, puts me in a kind of mindset where um, I go to sleep thinking good thoughts. I wake up thinking good thoughts, you know, and um, spreading a positive message in the morning has really impacted my life in a really amazing and beautiful way. And so many other people's as well. Uh, you know, we know that this week Nunavut entered a territory wide lockdown trying to contain outbreaks of COVID-19. How's lockdown going for you? What does it look like? Um, lockdown, on, to be completely honest, um, lockdown is, um, I've actually been kind of in my own little lockdown for quite a while. I don't usually leave the house very often, so um, um, to me personally, it hasn't changed much, but I just feel the tension all around. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, what are your concerns when it comes to mental health supports in your community? Um, <clears throat> well, my concerns is that there's a lack of knowledge in why why a lot of Inuit have mental health issues. You know, there's things that stem from intergenerational trauma, and um, there's a lot of issues that, like housing. Housing is a big um, big issue that um, it really affects mental health in a lot of Inuit. Um, there's there's many things many things to talk about. Not only do your videos, Annie, touch on mental illness and the need for support and for spreading positivity and joy, but I also love that they po po point out really unique elements of your culture. I'm going to share just one of those clips with our viewers, and I'll check in with you in a sec. Hang on. And I think one of my favorite things about Palawa with Inuit is that we don't use, like, exact measurements. Hold on, I'll show you. So this is my mom's bannock recipe. And as you can see, there's, like, four handfuls, four palmfuls, and yeah, they're different. I've always heard Inuit joke. Uh, I love that. And I, why did you decide to, to start posting those along with your positivity messages? I just feel like it's um, it's something that a lot of Inuit can relate to. Um, any person that I've kind of made Balagap with, or they kind of have the same dynamic where um, they use their hands or like, you know, they kind of just use their um, use their eyes to measure almost in a way. Uh, I want to end this interview, Annie, by giving you a chance to spread one of your positivity messages for today. What's your reason for staying alive today? Um, I was actually, I woke up not too long ago, so um, mm -hmm. I, I haven't really thought about that yet. I was thinking about getting into the Inuit IQ principles, the um, Inuit Kawi Matyokani principles. Um, I think I'll be touching on that today. Well, people are going to have to tune in to find out what you're thinking about today. Anna Buscemi, great to meet you. Yeah. Thanks for spreading your positivity and joy right across the country. Mm, thank you so much for having me. Thanks for watching. If you like this, be sure to subscribe here. And you can check out more Your Morning videos right here.